Guys, it's Fonzie here with DipYourCar.com. Now, normally when you see our, our videos come up, we're dipping cars. Uh, once in a while, we want to do something a little bit goofy, a little bit different, and it's October. There's things coming up and holidays, and we want to give you guys an idea of some projects you can do with, uh, with the dip as well as just show the versatility of the product. So what we're going to do today is actually we're going to dip a pumpkin, a jack-o'-lantern. Uh, change the color of your pumpkin, do whatever you want, uh, something different. Actually, let's just jump into the project. I'll show you what I mean. All right, guys, we've got a uh, dip your car jack-o'-lantern here. Um, nice, simple design. Basically, what we're going to do is we're going to dip it. We're going to make it a matte black pumpkin. What we want to do is we want to start with the inside of the pumpkin first because we don't want to get um, our spray pattern and our angles all the way down around it and get a nice, clean finish and then just start shooting on the inside and get overspray. So the first thing we're going to do is try to get the inside of it the best we can. Now, you're going to have to utilize a lot of different angles and actually roll the pumpkin around quite a bit to make sure you get it right but just bear with me on this one. Just kind of rotate it as you go. Utilize that fan to just cover as much of it as you can. Now you want to just try to get the inside of it as best you can. Get one good coat in there, one or two coats should be enough. Now obviously you're going to be changing the look of your pumpkin, but in, actual, in actuality what it does is that rubber coat just seals the inside and outside and actually makes it last a heck of a lot longer. Okay guys, we've got two coats on the inside, we've really let it kind of just dry and saturate. And actually one of the things I wanted to mention is if you get a pumpkin, um, you want it to be room temperature and just kind of as it is before you start dipping it. Don't take it out of a fridge or out of a cold store because it'll sweat a little bit and if it has condensation on the pumpkin, it's going to really affect the way the dip um, adheres to it. So it's nice and dry, ready to go. Um, we're going to put the top back on because we want you know the whole thing to be matte black on the outside. And believe it or not, it's just kind of like dipping a car. Just pay attention. To your angles, you want a nice smooth coat on it, so just kind of rotate around. Don't spray from the wrist like this. Rotate around the pumpkin, keep it at the same spray distance, and let's just get our first coat going. Don't worry about the inside angles on this coat yet. Let's just get a nice base coat around the face of it. All right, guys, we're, it's uh, dry to the touch now. We're going to put our second coat on. And on this one, the first thing I'm going to do is focus in on all these angles here. Now we're just going to go ahead and put coat number two on the actual pumpkin. All right guys, this is three coats of the matte black Plasti Dip, the original Plasti Dip in the spray can on a real pumpkin jack lantern It's funny, somebody just walked through the shop delivering something. They asked, dude, is that a real pumpkin? Um, it, does, it does look different, it's cool. Obviously you can do it with any color. The one thing I'm not gonna suggest, now some people are still putting, you know, the old school way of putting candles inside of pumpkins for jack o' lanterns. Um, Plasti Dip, um, when it is in its liquid form, is flammable. Obviously, it says it on the product. So I'm not suggesting that you guys start throwing candles in there. They have those little uh, those little lights that you can plug in. A lot of people are using those now. Um, anyway, you guys can figure that out. Just wanted to show you it's a way to make the the pumpkin actually last about a week longer. We tested it last year, and uh, it's just a cool little thing to do. So. Uh, Fonzie from Dip Your Car, if you have any questions, customer service at dipyourcar.com or you can always just give us a call. we got people here uh, willing to help you. Uh, enjoy the holidays and we'll see you in the next video.